Hello, my dear students, and welcome to this week overview. During this week, we will be talking about describing four different components of city planning. City planning is a comprehensive process that involves several interconnected components working collaboratively to shape urban spaces into organized, sustainable environments for residents. At the heart of this process is land use planning, a crucial element that designates spaces for various purposes, such as housing, commerce, industry, recreation, and institutions. By carefully allocating areas for different functions, this aspect of planning aims to prevent chaotic development, ensuring efficient land use and contributing to the creation of diverse and vibrant neighborhoods. Transportation planning is another integral component, focusing on the establishment of an efficient and sustainable network roads, public transit systems, pedestrian walkways, and cycling infrastructure. The goal is to enhance mobility, reduce congestion, and promote environmentally friendly modes of transportation. Well designed transportation systems not only facilitate movement but also play a vital role in fostering overall urban sustainability. Infrastructure planning is equally essential, addressing the development and maintenance of critical facilities like water supply, sewage systems, energy distribution, and waste management. Adequate infrastructure planning ensures that essential services are available to all residents, contributing to the overall health, well-being, and quality of life within the urban setting. Smart growth and new urbanism are planning concepts that advocate for more sustainable and livable urban environments. Smart growth emphasizes responsible land use, encouraging compact and efficient development, and promoting mixed land use to create walkable neighborhoods with easy access to public transit. New urbanism, on the other hand, focuses on designing communities that foster a sense of place, emphasizing pedestrian-friendly street, diverse housing option, and a mix of commercial and recreation spaces. Both approaches share common goals of reducing urban sprawls, enhancing environmental sustainability, and creating communities that prioritize the well-being and quality of life for residents. By integrating these principles into urban planning, cities can strive towards a more harmonious balance between economic development, social equality, and equity and environmental stewardship.